Okay, the main goal of this episode is to not have Daniel Big Ears Andrews appearing for once. Don't jinx it, Alex. But anyways, I'll roll the intro. Uh, Scotty, you forgot to put the disc in. Oops, I'll get around to doing that. <laughs> well, the disc is in the GameCube. But someone has been holding down the Z button. <laughs> and now someone is holding down Z on four controllers. Ah, uh, Scotty. Can you please stop holding down the Z button on the controller? We want the music done right. Sorry about that. I just wanted to have a bit of fun with the intro. Just be glad Sam isn't here. Sony PlayStation. The console, created following a failed partnership by Nintendo and Sony to make a CD add-on for the SNES. Hey gang, that's who's back in the studio. Spoiler, it's not Q the logo. Ah, Sam, you're finally back. You came out a good time too, as we were trying to get the intro done right. The timing worked out great, don't you think? But anyways, you know what to do, Scotty. Scotty, you're not supposed to mix in rival game consoles, okay? I just had the urge to play the original Xbox after this episode, hence why that logo appeared. Next, logo, goddammit. The Nintendo 64. More specifically, the Nintendo 64 DD, a failed add-on for the said console. This is the copyright police. We are seizing this logo, because it contains a copyrighted character owned by Nintendo and must be sent to the CP jail, on copyright grounds. Ah, crap. Not the copyright police again. Last thing we need is a copyright strike. Sega's Dreamcast, Sega's last ever game console. Scotty. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Sam. Do you have to scream like a spoiled brat? How dare you call me a spoiled brat? You're a fly Oh hell no! Rehire Scotty right now or else I'll fire you! Screw you, Alex. I allowed to summon Daniel Andrews in here. Don't you dare bring him in here! I promised at the beginning of the episode to the viewers that Daniel Andrews would not be appearing in this episode. I don't care. I'm still summoning him. These level crossings are a relic of the past. They have to go, and they are going. Damn it! Damn it all the hell! <laughs> I've returned yet again. Army of Victoria State Government logos, come out and play with our friends. Oh god, it's that stupid crappy Army of Victoria State Government logos again. How dare you insult the great Army of Victoria State Government logos. 
We'll spread propaganda across the studio now. Speaking of propaganda, I have some for all of you, especially Alex. Here it is. As a paramedic, I help in life-threatening situations. Seizures, drownings, babies on the way, or who stop breathing. It's my passion. In an emergency, I'm here for you. And this is how you treat me. Up to 95% of our healthcare workers have experienced verbal or physical assault. No matter what the situation, it's never okay. Damn it, Alex. How dare you ruin my propaganda? Take that! Well, I do agree with the subject that paramedics should not be treated like that. However, the message at the end of that commercial should read that instead. Now, I'm going to bring in your fierce opposition. Hello, Daniel Andrews. Or should I say, Daniel Dickiers Andrews? Not you again, Matthew Guy. Go back to having your lobster dinner with Tony McGaffrey. Shut up about that. You're also slowly destroying the MFVMCSA. Now you've really angered me, Alex. So, I'll be going on about level crossing removals. Now. Wait, goddammit. I'd ran out of things to say during the footage of the crossings being removed. So, I'll resort to this. This level crossing is a relic of the past. It's dangerous, congested, and it's holding the rail network back. However, that is actually total crap and I'm doing this just to annoy you, Alex. This, this is, is not okay. This needs to stop now. This is cancer. This, this is so much cancer that I can feel the tumors growing on my back. And it's way down heavy on me, and it's not okay. Can you help a out and just stop this? Please? Now, it's time to give you the atomic bomb. Finally, that ordeal with Daniel Andrews is over. Also, I'm sorry for firing you earlier, Scotty. I accept your apology, Sam. Now, I'll try my hardest to get the intro right. Whoa. That logo was incredibly loud. I wonder... If Daniel Andrews sent that in response to getting beaten back? If that's the case, it didn't scare me at all. Well, I think I've had enough for today. Let's try this again at another time.